A basketball team from a Canoga Park High School with only 207 students is making some big headlines this season. The AGBU Titans have moved up three divisions over the past three years. They finished last year undefeated, and this year they're looking to clinch their division and take the state championship. <laughs> them the unlikely high school basketball champs, the underdogs. We were counted out multiple times and we came to playoffs unranked, which means nobody thought we were worthy of being in the top 16. We are now in the CIF Division II semifinals. 11 players on a team, eight seniors, two sophomores and one freshman. They aren't the tallest on the courts, and they themselves will tell you they don't see themselves as the most talented players, but their preparation, determination, and resilience has them on a winning streak. The Armenian general Benevolent Union Titans were undefeated 21-0 last year. Their goal this year, to win the Southern Section Division 2A and state championship. When you come to watch us play, and you watch both sides warm up, we do not pass the eye test. We look like we're gonna lose by 30 points. The game is done. You look at us and you say, oh, very interesting. This is the team that everybody's talking about. Nara Kapushan has been coaching at this school for only the past five years, but he's been coaching these players since they were eight. I was once the tallest person in the room, and now I'm not. Coach Kapushin emphasizes student in the phrase student athletes. The whole team cumulatively has a 4.0 GPA. They work hard on the court and off the court. Academic studies come first, then comes practice six days a week, two hours of practice and an hour of film. In order for a team like ourselves to be successful, we really value the work. We value the discipline uh, and the preparation that goes into the game. The years of playing together, friendship, and sense of brotherhood comes organically to this team. It is that chemistry that on the court is electrifying, not to mention the boost in spirit and confidence they get from the community. It's just such a boost of energy, and it just feels like all the Armenian community could rally around something through these tough times. Senior Avon Dorian is six foot four, the team's leading scorer. He has a 4.7 GPA in colleges like Harvard, Princeton, Stanford, UCLA, USC, Caltech, and MIT have shown interest. But for him, it's the love of the game and his teammates that brings him the greatest joy. The part that I think makes us love basketball the most is the fact that we get to play it with all our friends. There's no nervousness around it. There's no one to impress. I really value every single game, every single practice. But competing with bigger schools makes us, makes our families proud, makes our community proud and shows us what we can do even though we're outsized always and we just find a way to compete and win. And something that makes things interesting and fun during games are twins Ryan and Michael Mardirosian. Sometimes the ref calls a foul on him. I have to clarify that it wasn't me, it was him. I mean, it wasn't him, it was me. Or the other way around. Other teams, even, they don't know the difference. We actually do get tired of spending so much time together, but I feel like we just understand each other to a whole different level on the court. I'm really confident going into Friday, no matter who we would play against, I'm confident because I know we're going to prepare better and we're going to be more disciplined than they are. If we don't win, we have everything to be proud of. We knew we had nothing to lose. We came in with high expectations and so far we have lived up to them. All right, how about that? Tonight is the playoff game. The AGBU Titans take on number one ranked Rancho Christian in Temecula in a semifinal game. And uh, both teams have already qualified for the state tournament, which begins February 28th. Now, if the Titans win tonight, they will advance to the Southern Section Finals for the first time in the school's history. We'll keep you posted on the journey. And, of course, we wish the Titans the best of luck. You know what I also love? The coach every uh, preseason comes up with a motto for the year mm -hmm. and this year's motto is pressure is a privilege. Oh, I like that. That's, that's a good one, right? Yeah. yeah. What a great story and what a great journey. We wish them nothing but net, right? <laughs> when they face off their Listen, competitor tonight. I feel invested in this story, Aroxia. So you can you just update us later? Yes. And just text, yes, we will. Can you text me and just let me know because I really do want to know. I don't want to see some highlights. 
I like We need that. to get Gus into the school. <laughs> I'm telling you, 4.7 GPA. This is crazy. I'm so proud of these guys. That's incredible. Not just um, the parents, I think. Are, <laughs> were they in tears earlier? I think you said that one of them texted you, right? Yes. Oh. Avon's dad texted yeah. me. He's like, I'm in tears and I don't <laughs> cry easily. So very, cute. very sweet. Oh, a lot of pride. They have a lot of support, which a is lot key, of you know? You need yeah. that and a, a lot of pride. So good parenting there as well. So yeah, please let me know who won uh, later today.